Hey guys, you guys know me. My name is Frank Berenger, uh, America's favorite and most loved and most handsome prairie dog. Uh, you may be wondering why I'm wearing my funky 1970s glasses. Well, uh, there's a reason. Well, first of all, uh, I got my, my buddy back here and uh, you don't know, but this here is a flashback. What we're doing is we're going back in time, and I'm going to tell you how I discovered one of the most brilliant musical minds in history, David Bowie. Yeah, I discovered him. Me, Frank Berenger, little prairie dog from Brooklyn. Yep. All right, here's the story. There's a, there's a little flashback, so we're going to go back in time now, and I'm going to tell you about my friend. His name was Arnold Finkelstein, all right? Arnold Finkelstein was over my house one day. We was talking on the couch. Uh, just like this here. It's Arnold. Uh, only back then, David Bowie wasn't called David Bowie. He was called Arnold Finkelstein. Who are you talking to? Oh, uh, you gonna take another nap? Yeah. Yeah, I'm lazy. I don't feel like doing nothing. Everything's boring. Oh, man, come on. Uh, why don't you sing? Uh, I heard you sing once. You got a great voice. Now, what are you talking about? He's not a good singer either. I could sing Happy Birthday. Now, I heard you singing the other day. You were doing that song with the numbers. One, five, one, five, C, one, five. On TV, C, one, five, yeah. That's a song I actually wrote when I wrote it on the piano. You see, you can write songs. Yeah, nobody wants to hear my crap. It's just garbage, Frank. I just want to do what I was born to do. I want to be a chess master. A chess master? Is there good money in that? Oh, sure. You could write books and go on tours and, and sign autographs and give speeches. and you know, Well, not really, but... Not really. Well, you should give it a shot. Come on. Finkelstein, I know you got it in you. Why don't you sing that song? What was it called again? TVC15. Yeah, yeah. Give me a little TVC15. Why don't you, why don't you give it to me, all right? Uh, all right. I need a little background music or something. Yeah. Wait, I got a karaoke machine. Give me a second, all right? Uh, hold on. Let me move the... Let me just uh, sit down here at the piano, and I'm going to play a little piano and stuff. I got it all programmed into my synthesizer. I love modular synthesizers. They're so intriguing. Oh, whatever. That's very nerdy. Listen, Arnold, uh, sing that song. We want to hear it. Let me hear it. Do, 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 do your best. Let's, let's hear what you got. All right. Let's hear Oh, 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 that's great. I love that song. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, yeah uh, can you sing a little deeper? Oh, oh, oh. What do you mean? Like, like lower? Yeah. Oh, 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 Look at the room, my TV is here on my head. I'm baby, I'm baby. I'm baby, I'm baby. Wait, 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 that's great. Whoa. Why didn't you stop me? That, that, you stopped me, it wasn't good, right? No, 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 that was great. When you changed your voice and you went down lower. What do you mean? Sing it lower uh, for me right now. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, now sing it higher. Uh, 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 uh. The lower voice, that's it, bro. That's it. That lower voice. Use that voice all the time. Just sing an octave lower. Really? You sound like a thousand times better. Plus, you need a new image. Hold on. I got a friend. They're going to hook you up. Her name is a major lady. Check, check this girl out. She has a great style. She's going to hook you up right now, all right? Hold, hold on a sec. Major Lady, come in here a second. Take a look at this guy. Hmm. 
Huh. Okay. We can work with him. What's your name? My name is Arnold. Oh, that voice, it won't do. The, do the low voice, Arnold. Tell it, tell it, tell it, the low voice. It's better like this. Is it better like this? Great. Okay, let's move it to the side. Well, what's that thing you're wearing? What, what are you wearing on your back there? Oh, that? That's a... It's like a, a space-themed cape. Do you see? It's kind of like a superhero from space. Oh, man, you got the best style. Yo, can, can he borrow some of that stuff? Do him up that style. Do up Arnold that style. We can't call him Arnold. He needs a new name. Uh, uh, something Jewish. Yes, it must be something Jewish. Uh, Chaim? How about David? David, yes, I like that. David Finkelschmeier? No, no, we can't use that last name. Well, what, what will he be called? David Bowie. Bowie? Yeah, it's a knife. It's a Bowie knife. My, my dad used to give me these knives when we used to go hunting and stuff. I didn't know rats went hunting. Hey, how do you know I'm a rat? I'm a stylist. I know everything. Cool. All right. Do up Arnold with your style, with all that uh, space stuff, like your, like your cape, all right? And, and give him, like, the same color hair as yours. You got the best style. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, I, I owe you a big one. Well, a case of cream soda would help. You got it. I'll send a case of cream soda to your house. You got it. Two cases, all right? And make it five. Oh, thank you so much. All right, give me five minutes with this guy. What are you going to do? I mean... What are you going to do with me? I've got a perfect idea. Something I've been working on. But, well... I haven't had the courage to do it. What is it? Just give me a minute, okay? It's the big premiere. Everybody, yeah, everybody take your seats. Come on, come on, it's the big premiere and stuff here. Get me a seat, come on. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to present to you a monumental, towering talent. Ladies and gentlemen, for his first time on stage, meet... David, David Bowie. Bowie. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, Yay! Yeah. Put it down, Mario. Adam. Look at Mr. Bowie, he's so cool. Shh, quiet, Mario. I'm not the king. You, you are the queen. Everything is done away. Just for one day. Yeah, you can be heroes. Just for one day. And you, I look at the moon. 
And I uh, love to go to the town with the robots DJing and click, 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 and hold. And that is a fact. Click, 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 just for one day, we yeah. can be heroes forever and ever. What's he say? Is that your friend? Yeah, yeah, that's my friend Arnold up there. Isn't he great? Well, he's dating us. Uh, I wish you could stay here. I can be heroes. I'd like to give a shout out to my best friend, Frank. Thank you, Frank. And my delighted. And even his big name friend, his friend looks like a balloon, Mario. Oh my god, he's like my name, yay! Oh, the king! Are you? Are you the king? Yay! So, David Bowie, uh, uh, let me ask you something, uh, David, uh, do you miss uh, Arnold Finkelstein? Well, not really. I mean, it's much nicer being British. And now, you know, well, I'm probably going to marry Major Lady. She's very beautiful and we like each other a lot. Oh, that's great. I'm so happy for you. Yeah, and I'm in his band. I'm DJing. Oh, uh, Lobo. Does that mean we get to go see David Bowie whenever he plays Lobo? Yep. And I get to be on stage and go... Quick, quick, wiggity, wiggity, wiggity. <laughs> That's right, yep. That was great. Oh, my gosh. I just wonder, you know, you don't ever miss being Arnold Finkelstein? Not really, Frank. There's just one thing. I know Major Lady kind of, like, created your look and everything, and uh, I just want to wait till she was gone because I, I, I got a little present for you myself here. Hey, what's that, Frank? Yeah, what's that, Frank? Oh, well, I thought it would be cool. Uh, you know, maybe uh, kind of like your signature, your trademark. It's an eye patch. What do you think? An eye patch? But my, my eye isn't hurt. No, no, no. It's, n it's not for a hurt eye. It's just for fashion. Get it? Just for fashion. And eventually people will just be like, oh, it's just for fashion. Just like... David Bowie. Yeah, give it to me, Frank. I want to try that. That's a great, great idea. Yeah, go ahead, put it on. See what you think. A little bit tight, but I think it's a good fit. Okay. Yeah, love it. Presenting David Bowie. Hey, you know what? Frank, this is a great idea. With this idea, maybe I'm going to create a new character. What do you mean, a character? Just like on Luigi Tunnel, I'm going to have my own characters. It's going to be called Ziggy Stardust. Ziggy Stardust. You just became David Bowie. You're already becoming a new guy? Yeah. With the eye patch, I'm going to be Ziggy Stardust. 
thanks to you, Frank. I think it's going to be my most successful album ever. Oh, uh, well, you're a humble prairie dog. But, uh, well, you know, I like to give my two cents now and then. Uh, you look great, David. Uh, good luck, all right, bro? You too, Frank. Thanks for giving me my signature look. Next time when I play as Ziggy Stardust, I'm going to invite you. You're going to come on stage with me, all right? Oh, you got it. Wow, Ziggy Stardust, what a great idea. Thanks, Frank. Uh, you got it, you got it, David. Yep, that is exactly how it happened. The whole David Bowie eye patch and Ziggy Stardust thing, that was me. I mean, that, that major lady, she had a big influence on his whole thing, you know, but uh, when they were dating, but the whole eye patch and the whole Ziggy thing, that was me. Some people say well, he had a dog named uh, Doggy Stardust and he took it off the dog, but nah, Behringer. Wow, I didn't know that, Frank. Did you wind up seeing Ziggy Stardust from the front row? Yup, for the whole tour. I went on tour with him. Yup, that was his chef, his personal chef. Because he only liked what they call macrobiotic food back then. It was like a trend. And I happened to be the number one macro chef in New York City. So, you know, I went on tour with him. Made sure he was eating healthy. And uh, we had a ball. Next time he comes to town, we'll all go, all right? Ziggy Stardust, wow. I love Mr. Bowie. Yeah, he's a good guy. What other rock stars did you help to discover? Uh, I, I don't want to brag, you know. A few, a few. Wow, you're so cool, Uncle Frank. Yeah, well, that's why I'm America's favorite prairie dog. That's right. So, everybody, we'll see you next time for uh, another big old adventure with me and Mario. Don't forget me, Lobo. Yep. And, uh, everybody, we'll uh, see you soon, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. See, I'm going to turn this thing off. Oh, yeah.